IT is the world-renowned collection of art and historic artifacts in Scotland that was once banned from leaving Great Britain. But now it has emerged that over a million people have enjoyed the touring exhibition of the Burrell Collection nationally and internationally over the past three years while its home in Glasgow was being refurbished. The international element of the roving exhibition, along with one-off loans of objects was sanctioned after a controversial act was passed by the Scottish Parliament in 2014 allowing the collection to tour internationally. It was originally against the wishes of Sir William Burrell, who left his collection of paintings, sculptures, textiles and antiquities to Glasgow in 1944. A shipping magnate, he was aware of the dangers of international freight and forbade his treasures to be sent overseas. The Burrell Collection, Lending and Borrowing, Bill Committee had not fully convinced by Glasgow's claim that the tour would generate a £15 million contribution to the refurbishment of the building. The law change permitted the planned world tour to raise funds for the collection's A-listed building in Pollock Park that has been closed since late 2016 for a revamp which will expand display space and improve visitor facilities. It has been confirmed that so far 1.3 million people have visited exhibitions featuring works collected by Sir William Burrell in venues that range from Tokyo to London. The total number of visitors who have enjoyed objects from the Burrell collection rises to over 4 million by including single loans of objects to museums which were not in temporary exhibitions when counting venue visits. The tour which began in 2016, has seen parts of the collection going overseas for the first time since it was given to Glasgow. It is due to conclude next year before the Burrell collection opens again to the public in the spring of 2021. Nearly 30 venues around the world will have hosted art from the Burrell Collection by the time the museum reopens to the public. Included are loans to New York's Metropolitan Museum and the Musée de Cluny in Paris. It emerged last week that a further £1 million was to be invested in the Burrell Collection's Renaissance project as part of its refurbishment. Glasgow City Council agreed to spend £1,589,150 on an audiovisual display at the museum in Pollock Country Park, including a video wall and projection, touch screens, tablets and computers. The £66 million budget for the Burrell Renaissance project was approved in February 2017 by the council's then executive committee. This included £15 million from the Heritage Lottery Fund. Among the venues which hosted objects from the Burrell Collection are the British Museum which borrowed Rodin's The Thinker and the National Gallery in London which displayed 22 works as part of Draw Knife. For more on this story, visit the news article link.